Hi everyone, it is an absolutely splendid day for football and we're looking forward to the game. I'm Derek Ray and I'm joined here on the gantry for commentary by Stuart Robson. And we have live action from the Bundesliga coming right up. It's Mainz up against Stuttgart. Thanks Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, pinning the opposition back, playing the ball forward and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully we get a really good game here. Well, you can probably see why we're focusing on this fellow as one to watch. Stuart, in particular, what do you expect to see from him? Well, Derek, I'm sure he's going to be tightly marked today because in the last match, he was outstanding. He got his two goals, but it was his general play that was brilliant. And I'm sure we're going to see more of the same today. Here's the initial 11 for Mainz. Well, when they don't have possession, it will be a back five. But when they win the ball back, the wing backs will push further forward to make it a 3 5 2. And so the Stuttgart starting 11. Well, the two wide players are great in 1v1 situations, and their movement is also very good. But it's the midfield three that will need to control the flow of the game. And now they get the ball rolling. Moving into the advanced position. But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. Playing with purpose and control. Wataru Endo. And the cross is very much on. Well, it's one pass after another. Bonna Sosa. Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. Silvan Widmer. Can they create something from here? Lee J. Sung. Might be able to set up the chance. Oh, but cutting it out in the nick of time. Space to cross it. Oh, he's given us away inexplicably. Magnificent defending. Kalajic still passing it around with authority. A wonderful intervention. Well, he's lost the ball. Sasha Kalajic. He continues his run. Defended well. Well, knocked on the target. The keeper seemed to have it covered. Well, he did seem to have it covered, but it's not a bad effort, though. He really did strike it well. Martin. Another 
on the scent of something positive. Really getting stuck in defensively. Sylvain Widmer making progress. Lee Jae Sung. Oh, a good diving save. Well, this is a big moment, and don't these fans know it? And he's fired over the corner. Taking care of business defensively here. Good looking sequence. Targets available. Cross comes in. And a goal! 1 0 it is. They've been pushing for the opener, and now they have it. Let's see this again, because the delivery into the box couldn't be any better. Played into just the right area, and it's a comfortable finish in the end, which is made to look so easy. It's a lovely goal. Back underway, and 1-0 it is. Let's see what happens next. The referee has decided there will be just one minute of added time. Running with the ball confidently, and credit is due for that good piece of defending. So the whistle then, we're at the halfway stage in this match. I think most fans would be pretty happy with this man's display so far. Well, I'm sure the manager will be delighted with him. He'll have drilled it into them to keep their focus, keep playing through to the half-time whistle, and it's certainly put them in a good position to go on and win this now. anticipated plenty of talking points so far and now the second half is underway <laughs> Sasha Kalajic and scope for them to produce something exciting but strong play here on the shielding front Atakan Karazor patient build up at the moment and a fine stop to turn the ball away. Pressing high to win the ball. I don't think he'll be proud of that challenge. And it's left to the referee to decide what happens next. And this ordering off could mean the end of their push today. Well, there's no way back now. He's really let his teammates down here. Well, they are committed to making the substitution here. Jean-Paul Boetius. Chance here. Wonderful header. Excellent goalkeeping. Corner awarded. Here it is now. A substitution. <laughs> 
He's driven in the corner. Well, the defender deserves a bit of credit, to be fair. Yeah, I think you have to give credit to the defending there. Just enough pressure to put him off at that vital moment. Peters out, and that means it's goalkeeper's ball. Well, as you can see, the visitors have had most of the ball, but their attacking play hasn't been good enough so far. There's been too many safe passes and no real penetration. They certainly need to up the tempo if they're going to get back into this one. Could be! Terrific save! And the substitution will occur now. time tackle far from a good pass Mavropanos Kalajic Endo and moving the ball nicely. Mongala. Shielding the ball superbly. Well, he's thwarted him almost effortlessly. It might be on for them. Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Oh, sure. Denied by the bar, back in play here. And the danger clear. Well, that would certainly have put them in a great position. But with only a one goal lead, they're never going to be able to relax. He's going forward well here. And let's give credit to the defending. Well, just listen to this atmosphere. It's been such a tight game, but the fans are certainly doing their bit in trying to get them over the finish line. They've got to be really mindful of the time situation, attacking though they might be. No way through. Boetius. A good effective pressure high up the pitch. A chance to whip it in. There's an effective clearance. Poetius into the advanced position but quick thinking defensively Dominic Koa And there it is, the final whistle, and the fans will be leaving the stadium with smiles on their faces. Well, Derek, they didn't dominate the game by any means today, but overall they had the better of the chances and just about deserved their win. Well, we're focusing on him for a reason. Played with real authority and attack, Stuart. Well, he obviously scored the winning goal, but it was his overall performance that impressed me most. He was on fire today.